This is coming from MilitaryLeak.com. The second consecutive flight test of its candidate next-generation surface-to-surface missile solution for the U.S. Army's Precision Strike Missile Program, conducted by Lockheed Martin Missiles and Fire Control. This is to replace the Army Tactical Missile System. The second consecutive flight test takes place at White Sands Missile Range, New Mexico. The missile's range in the test was 180 kilometers, which was shorter than the first flight test, because this time, the test will be more challenging, as the missile must go up faster and come down quicker. The missile's launch trajectory guidance and impact performed exactly as expected. The two company Lockheed and Raytheon are now locked in a head-to-head -head competition to replace the Army tactical missile system. According to the source, Lockheed now has two flight tests under its belt, but Raytheon is lagging. The latter company was supposed to test its version of precision strike missile late last year, but technical difficulties delayed the test, and it still has yet to be rescheduled. The goal for the U.S. Army is to initially field a precision strike missile in 2023. This will be the one of the major development efforts within the services for the long-range precision fires portfolio. So what do you think about the development of U.S. next-generation surface-to-surface missile? Just comment down below. And let's see if we can tackle it in the next episode.